If I had to pinpoint where I fell in love with Donald Glover, it would probably be between the first time I watched Community and the 50th time I listened to Camp. My name is Jacoby from The Bundle, and I'm here to give you the rundown of one of my biggest idols, Donald Glover, born on September 25th, 1983. He was raised in Stone Mountain, Georgia, a location significantly prevalent in his art. Glover graduated from NYU in 2006 with a degree in dramatic writing. He was also involved in the sketch comedy group Derek Comedy, who produced the movie Mystery Team in 2009. Look how big my magnifying glass is! Donald Glover sent writing samples to executive producer David Miner his senior year of college. Miner and Tina Fey loved them, and he was welcomed to the writing team for 30 Rock. The team won the Writers Guild of America Awards for Best Television Comedy Series in 2007, 2008, and 2009. He left the writing team in 2009 and picked up the role of lovable nerd Troy Barnes in NBC's comedy, Community. The show's cast won the TV Guide Award for Favorite Ensemble in 2012. He left the show in its fifth season in 2013 and revealed in a string of written notes on Instagram that he had been feeling very lost and hopeless. In 2008, Donald Glover entered his name into the Routine Clan name generator, as you would, and out came the name that we all know and love, Childish Gambino. Gambino's first studio album released on November 15th, 2011, Camp. It featured singles Bonfire and Heartbeat. By the way, Donald Glover had performed a couple of stand-up shows up to this point. He even landed an hour special on Comedy Central in 2011 titled Weirdo. But the piano's not a piano, it's just a bear, it's a live bear. For some reason he's playing and the bear's not eating Kanye because he has so much respect for him. Glover kept working diligently on his music, releasing his second studio album, Because the Internet, in 2013. He was so into the project that he produced a short film, Clapping for the Wrong Reasons, to serve as an interlude for the story of the album. The story was outlined in a screenplay weaving in the songs from the album. Glover returned to the camera and signed with FX to serve as an executive producer, writer, director, and lead role in the TV series Atlanta. Atlanta has won numerous awards, including the Emmy for Outstanding Lead Actor in a Comedy Series and Outstanding Directing for a Comedy Series. Glover is the first black person to win that particular directing award. What? Well done. Childish Gambino returned with a funky new sound in late 2016 with the album Awaken My Love, which featured the ever popular Redbone. Glover went on to win the Grammy for Best Traditional R&B Performance with the song. So what's next for the powerful black icon Donald Glover? Well, he will be playing THE Lano Calrissian in Solo, A Star Wars Story, coming out this May, and Simba for the Lion King remake Disney is cooking up. Glover has also announced that his next album under the name Childish Gambino will be his last. I don't think it'll be his last album ever. As for television, Season 2 of Atlanta returns to FX in March. So uh, yeah. Mr. Glover is building big things. I just hope to be half as big as him someday. My name is Jacoby from The Bundle, and thank you for watching.